Hello friends, welcome. In this video, I'm going to work with mail. So uh, I'm going to use the mailtrap.io. If you go and create an account here, go to the my inbox. And here we have this select. If you go and select the Laravel, here we have our credentials, how to use for this SMTP. This is mailtrap.io. If you go to the project inside the config we have the mail mail php and here the default is smtp okay or we can change in the .env file we have this mail mailer var variable and this smtp has the transport which is smtp host which by default is uh, mailgun.org smtp mailgun.org or we can change in the .env file with mail host variable the same thing for port encryption username and password so to send mail we need the uh, mail host mail port encryption username and password and we have all them here in the mailtrap.io so let's copy them and let's go in the .env file and paste it here when we have the mail just replace with what we and save close this one now to send mail with laravel is very easy let's go first we need to create the mail class so let's go in the terminal and say php artisan make mail and give it a name and i'm going to name it test mail okay now mail created successfully let's go in the vs code inside the app mail we have this test mail php which is a php class which extend, extends the mailable now here we have the construct and also the build function function which return the view right now it set the view name so we need to create a new view and add that path here so let's go and do that inside the resources views i'm going to create a new folder name it emails and here i'm going to create a new file and i'm going to name it test.blade.php and add that here so return this view now this view is pointing to the views here and we created the emails folder so let's say emails here and we named the blade test so let's add test here okay let's save it and let's uh, close for now now in this test blade.php i'm going to add h1 to say mail from essential and let's add a paragraph just to say test mail save it Let's close and now to send mail, I'm going to create new route. So let's go inside the routes, web.php, and here I'm going to create new route. I'm going to say route get and I'm going to say slash contact. So when we navigate in the slash contact, I'm going to send that mail. So I'm going to create a closure. okay and here let's say now to send mail we need to call the mail facade so make sure you import the mail here use illuminate support facades mail and i'm going to say mail to the let's say test email.com and 
called the send method. Here we need to add the mailable. So I'm going to say new and the mail we created. So call the test mail. Now we send the email. So let's close this, save it. And if we navigate in the slash contact, it's going to send a new mail with, with uh, this line of code. So mail to the, we added the email here. We can add the user if we have a user. And Laravel by default is going to get the email of that user. But right now I just added the hard coded mail. And we say send new mail. And this now this test mail is returned in this view. And in here we have this uh, mail from essential and test mail. So let's go and see in the essential test. Let's replace this with uh, contact. Hit enter. And it's taking some time. So yeah, it's redirecting. If I come here, here it is. Test mail. And dot the test at email.com we have this mail from essential which is the h1 and the p tag for test mail what we added in the test blade okay the same thing we have here that's it how easy is the send mail with uh, laravel okay so see you in the next video friends all the best